from Lewis Center on the campus of Olentangy Orange. This is your Orange Juice. With anchors, Reagan Yamasaki and Ella Niles. Your Orange Juice starts right now. This year, we've worked hard to raise our coverage of politics here at the Juice, including the Beto O'Rourke rally, Dem primary, and local elections. Tanner Lambert and Rafi Zafar were able to check out President Trump's Kentucky rally and hear from some attendees. Hey, Pioneers. I visited Lexington, Kentucky at the University of Kentucky's campus where President Donald Trump was holding a rally for Governor Matt Bevin in his re-election campaign. There was a big turnout at the rally. The Rupp Arena was filled to capacity. Many people came to show their support for the president and the governor. We met with a few supporters who were open and willing to share their thoughts. God brought us from Mexico to the States. I got my citizenship on September the 25th, and uh, I registered to vote on September the 27th. And uh, I'm so proud of my president because he's pro-life. I know that he's the man that God chose for such a time as this for America. He's giving us another opportunity as a nation. And I believe that his name is even prophetic. He is a trumpet, a trumpet, Trump, a God's trumpet for America for such a time as this. I'm proud to be able to vote for my president, for my governor, and uh, make America great again. Um, well, I've been a lifelong Republican all my life. Um, I'm scared to death about socialism getting into our country, and I think Donald Trump is going to save us from, at least for the next few years from having socialism, and hopefully it'll never come, and the you know, younger generation will get educated and know that that's not the way to go. I am here to show my support for President Trump and hopefully drop some knowledge bombs on these here liberals behind me. There were also a decent amount of protesters present at the rally. They were protesting on the president's agenda for the evening, as well as the re-election of Matt Bevin. We talked with them and got a few of their ideas. Yeah, I'm from Turkey actually, and these are kind of things are not so unfamiliar to me. Same thing happened in Turkey, that kind of polarization crisis, and then it kind of ruins the country, I believe. I'm mostly here for the people. I'm not really here to be like, oh, I hate this person or I hate that. I'm mostly here to try and help out the people because I know everybody's got a side to this, but I think that everybody should be out here more like loving each other, talking it out, because yelling and fighting is not going to get us anywhere out here at this point. There was a tremendous turnout at the rally for both sides. The governor and the president are hoping for a win in Kentucky. We're excited to see the results. Thanks, guys, for keeping our students informed on politics. Did you know that the November edition of The Courier comes out this Friday? Be sure to bring a dollar to read all about stories including OSD, watching what we search, local elections, and much, much more. Now let's throw it over to Grace Porball with some motivation for your Monday. Hello Pioneers, this is Grace Porball in for Abby Fulton and this is your week's Motivational Monday. No matter what is going on in your life right now, I just want you to know that everything will be okay. You are so much stronger than you think you are and you can get through anything that you set your mind to. Even if things feel difficult or even hopeless right now, everything will fall into place. I believe in you and so do so many other people, so don't hesitate to ask for help if you need it. That's all I have for, today, for you today. Stay safe, Nears. Thanks, Grace. I didn't feel motivated this morning, but I sure do feel motivated now. That wraps up what we have for you today, Pioneers. Remember to check out our live radio station, WPOP The Pulp, on the Mixler app, and check out some great stories on OOHScourier.com. I'm Ella Niles with The Juice. And I'm Reagan Yamasaki. Remember to stay juicy, and please stand for your pledge. A nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.